I toured a lot of different campuses and I was very nervous about going away to college and I walked on the Roger Williams campus and it just right away felt like it was actually somewhere I could live. Roger Williams has a really strong sense of community and especially within the architecture school um, it's sort of a home away from home and then your your studio mates become your family away from family. It was a big transition coming here. I thought it was going to be so hard. I honestly thought and my parents were worried and but it was easy. I mean yeah I mean I could do it. I guess anyone can do it. Living in the dorms you meet all different kinds of people. You become close with a lot of them just because you see them every day. What I think is really great about Roger Williams that sets us apart from other universities that I've been to, that I have friends that go to, is that there's really personal interaction with faculty. I mean, all of the classes that you have are very small. They're 10 to 20 students. So you have that personal relationship with the professor. I've never had a class here that's just a lecture class. There's always the small group discussions either with the professor or break out into small groups with other students and then come back and then just have discussion. And that's what I really like. Advice I would give freshmen is to connect with your teachers. Because the professors here are just so invested and give you so many opportunities for growth. As a student here at Roger Williams, you are more than welcome to come down to the waterfront and rent a kayak for free and just take it out, explore Mount Hope Bay. It's an absolutely gorgeous place to go kayaking. It's so easy to become involved, it really is. And you know, you only have 15 hours of class. So what do you do with the rest of your hours in the week? You know, you, you meet people, you socialize, you get involved, you plan programs. It's really wonderful. I got involved in Alternative Spring Break and I went to South Carolina and I worked with Habitat for Humanity. I studied abroad my junior year in the spring in Florence, Italy. Just absolutely make it so that you can study abroad some point during your college career. It was an invaluable experience. I, I got the chance to go to Greece and Germany and Spain. I'm involved in the business fraternity. Uh, I've done that since freshman year and ballroom dancing is the other thing I did. I figured uh, I was going to a lot of weddings this summer after my freshman year. I should learn how to dance. One piece of advice that I would give incoming freshmen would be to get involved in as much as they can as soon as they come here. Also just take advantage of the time that you're in school because um, the freedoms that we're given in our studios are obviously much greater than the real world so yeah, take advantage of them while you can here. A lot of the advisors actually encourage you to take different classes because you can then find what you like. I never thought I would be a marketing major, but after taking a couple of courses, I honestly knew this was for me. Our campus is small enough so that you know everyone by sight, but it's big enough so you don't have the drama that's in your high schools. So you know, all of those students who are worried about going to a huge school and getting lost, or worried about going to a really small school and not enjoying themselves, I think that we're a perfect match. I've learned to just go out and go for what I want rather than just settling for what's already given to me. I would love to be involved in the film industry and a lot of that came from my professors here who pushed me in that direction and sort of gave me the tools that I needed. Now I want to take everything that I've learned and go and apply it to do something to, to make change in the real world. I'm excited to be able to start a new journey and see where it takes me.